and the jet range jet range is nothing but when we will be using it the force how much meters it will be it can go up to that's the jet range and it can whatever uh, the from the, from the standing usage the uh, place it can go up to 4 to 6 meters based on the pressure inside while uh, coming out with the pressure uh, it, it can reach up to 4 to 6 meters and the discharge time discharge time is 60 to 120 seconds means to empty the cylinder to empty the cylinder it will take 60 to 120 seconds it's nothing but one minute to two minutes within that two minutes it will empty it for the gas cartridge but when it comes to the stored pressure type it will take about just 50 to 90 seconds 50 to 90 seconds is nothing but less than one minute to one and a half minute that's it it will take that that much of time time to just discharge the full cylinder and the discharge will be 95 percent the 95 percent of uh, the material which is available inside the fire extinguisher will be emptied. The, only the 5% will be remaining because some factors will be coming into that one. The, for that 5%, everything can't be emptied at the time. That's the main reason. And this water type can only be used for the solid material like class A fires, what we have uh, seen in the yesterday class. The class A fire is for combustible materials like paper, wood, rubber, and this one, clothes. Apart from sir, this, sir, one, sir, 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 Cartridge is nothing but it will be like a cylinder which will be available in the fire extinguisher it it will be useful when uh, when the material combines depends upon the material whatever the material is inside well, like foam or co2 whatever it will be available because we can't use directly the material some pressure should be there that pressure will be created by the stored pressure or compressed pressure which will be uh, using or the cartridge, cartridge, which will be inside the cylinder to pressurize the material for uh, extinguish uh, to put on the put off the fire. That's it. But cartridge won't be uh, that pressure won't be normal pressure. Sometimes it will be mixed with some gases also like nitrogen or something. Nitrogen will be included in DCP because by combining with that one, we can extinguish the fire. But the cartridge will be mainly uh, the pressurized one that includes with the, that will that will be combined with the material which will be available in the extinguisher to extinguish the fire. That's the main reason. And okay. Mm. And the caution in water fire extinguisher, you can see in the caution that water fire extinguisher cannot be used for the flammable liquids or mainly for the electricity. Because you people know that why we can't use water for electrical fires. Can anyone say that one? Why we can't Spread use it? Water spread that, that, that's one of the reasons. The main reason is nothing but water is a good conductor of electricity. It can yes, spread. Sir, mm. Water is a good conductor of electricity. That's the main reason we are not supposed to use water for electricity fires or flammable liquids. And next comes the mechanical foam fire. This one also comes in the pressurized cartridge as a well, gas cartridge, as well as the stored pressure. Stored pressure is nothing but we will be injecting pressure inside. That's the that's the only thing. For that, for this one, you can see uh, 
can you see this one the marked place this one is nothing but pressure gauze pressure gauze will be available on the fire extinguisher to check whether pressure is in appropriate condition or not if in case the pressure is in red the pressure needle is on red we are not supposed to use that one because even it's high or less the pressure is not applicable uh, that's not usable the fire extinguisher if it's in green it's good to use that's the main reason for the pressurized one will be having this one for even for the dcp also but you can't find that one the pressure goes on the co2 fire extinguisher you can't find that and mechanical foam will be having a cream color cream color identification yeah like you can see in this one the the cream color uh, this one uh, background is there on that background it will be having foam written as a foam for, for our identification and this this one also comes under only nine liters only only nine liters cylinders will be available and it the jet range will be around three meters to five meters for both of the stored pressure as well as the gas cartridge and the discharge time differs based on the material see from the water and the foam you can see the difference so for the water it has been given 60 to 120 seconds but here for this one gas cartridge has uh, they have given 60 to 90 seconds only that means one minute to one and a half minute that's it discharge time two it will empty the cylinder within that time for the stored pressure 40 to 50 seconds that means less than a minute and discharge quantity for the gas cartridge will be 95 percent and the stored pressure will be 90 percent and you can apply this one for the class a fires and the class b fires what's the class b fires can anyone say yesterday only we have discussed this one what Prasad or Sunil? Who has spoke? Sunil, yes, sir. So, I'm a class attend all sir. And the classes attend the already YouTube link, sir. YouTube after link chill at the time for the day, for two to three days, okay. maybe Saturday and Sunday and link chat for certain. Okay, sir. Class B fires are nothing but flammable liquids and gases. Those are the cl class B fires. And the mechanical foam is only mainly mechanical foam. These foam fire extinguishers are used only for the flammable liquids and gases only. And here also they have given caution that not to be used on the electrical fires. Mostly electrical fires, we can use only the CO2 cylinders. Carbon dioxide fire extinguisher, you can find this one in a different types of quantities, like depends upon your usage and the location. You can get it in 2 kgs, 4.5 kgs and 6.8 kgs. Most probably the 6.8 kgs will be taken in the industries. For the work locations, for the cabins or wherever the electrical fires will be there and even for the DGs also, but will be, uh, we have to ensure that this one will be used in two quantities. That means two cylinders has to be kept near to the DGs based on the capacity of this uh, DG also, generator also. And <clears throat> this will be having a black background with a white wording. That's one of the identification for the carbon dioxide, okay? And you can see the jet range. It will be for 
one point uh, one meter to one point five meter depends upon this one they have given the weightage and everything for the two cases it's one one to one point five meters and for one for four point five cases it's one point five meter to two meters and for the six to uh, six point eight cases it's one point five to two meters and discharge quantity also most probably the discharge quantity will be 90 to 95 percent for each and every cylinder and they have given for class b and class c and i don't think so uh, this can uh, they will most most people will be using this one in the electrical pipes only Wherever the working locations, you can't find the mechanical foam or this carbon dioxide for this uh, flammable liquids or uh, flammable gases because this one having a different uh, what uh, will be called uh, this one will be having a different type of uh, action on the flare uh, fires that's the main reason because uh, the carbon dioxide while dealing with the fires like the oils it can't extinguish uh, it, it it can extinguish but it will take so much of time compared with the other ones that's the main reason but to, for this one the electrical fires the one of the main reason is that uh oxygen uh, will be there but water quantity won't be there and the carbon dioxide comes with uh, uh, comes out of the cylinder as a minus degree celsius minus 20 or something else it will be coming out uh, to control the heat and everything one of the main reasons what we have discussed yesterday for this uh high triangle in the fire triangle we have seen that fuel heat and heat oxygen, fuel, oxygen. If any of these three can if any one of these three has been eliminated we can put off the fire that's the main reason heat will be deactivated while using the carbon dioxide using minus 20 degrees and it's centigrade And for using this cylinder, we have to make sure that some few things has to be considered because if it's not properly used, the CO2 cylinder, we can get and cold burns. That's one of the main reason because the uh, with the pressure and everything, the carbon dioxide will be coming with a temperature of minus 20 degrees Celsius that can harm us as a by having a cold burns for that cause we have to make sure we we are properly handling the cylinder and we have to make sure one more thing is we we are using the pps proper pps while using this carbon dioxide cylinder and one more a yeah, common one most common one and most used fire extinguisher in the industries they went there aapka ek sawal hai at the devender is not uh, available or something okay dry chemical powder is nothing but dcp you can call it as a dcp and most probably it will be marked with a blue background and white wording and it, these identifications are just for us to check for, uh, these are just for identifying for our purpose so from the far distances also in case of Emergency fires, it easy. It, it will be very easy to identify. That's the main reason. These are these types of identifications will be there, and blue color will be there for blue background with white word uh, lettering. Okay. 
it might be you have seen this one in the powder in the picture but sometimes it will be written as dcp also and most probably it will be coming in different types as uh, the uh, co2 you have seen whatever the co2 uh, different weightage you have seen it will also comes in different weightage as one well. and the main substance the dcp will be coming with a sodium bicarbonate powder pressurized with a nitrogen sodium bicarbonate and in the few, in the coming one you can see this one in this one the first thing application they have given class b and c fires okay but the main reason for this one i think yesterday i have told you once again i'll be telling that class c fires is nothing but the this one the kitchen uh, electrical fires but while using on the cable it's okay the dcp but when you are using for any generators or electrical equipments in case of fires it will be different because this sodium bicarbonate can damage the equipment also that's the main reason they won't be using the dcp most probably the electrical because of this sodium bicarbonate the equipment may can dam may get damaged the, this is one of the reason they were most probably dcp won't be using for electrical points most probably 90 percent every company will be using only the co2 cylinders for the electrical points and for the remaining price you can use the dcp for that and it comes under 5 kg but we i have seen the dcp in different weightages also and it can discharge up to 90 to 95 percent same but here the discharge time you can see the least time you can observe when you have seen for the co2 and mechanical form as well as for this um, water type also this one will be empty discharge uh, in a fraction of uh, time and its jet range is also far better compared with the other ones like four to five meters five to six meters and it will be emptied within half minute. You won't get that much time. Depends upon the fire, you can, you have to use the other fire extinguisher also. If the fire is more compared to, uh, if the fire extinguisher is not uh, uh, up, uh, it's not uh, suitable for the fire because it will be less quantity. Uh, I think it, would, it comes under 9 cages also, the DCP, not only 5 cages. A, B, C type. This one is also, uh, we'll be having different types of fire extinguisher in, in weightage, in weight. The main extinguishing substance is mono uh, ammonium powder pressurized with nitrogen and the weightage comes with 500 grams 1 kg 2 kg and 5 kg and 10 kg and it's most probably used in any type of fires like a b c class a class b class c fires it can be used but as i said for the class c fires most probably DCP can also be used, but they won't use the DCP. Most of the time, 90% they'll be using only CO2. <clears throat> and you can see this uh, jet range capacity of this uh, based on their weightage. Whatever the weight is there, 1 kg, 2 kg. For the 1 kg, you can see 2 to 4 meters of jet range. And 2 kg for uh, 2 to 4 meters. And for 10 kg, you can see 5 to 6 meters. And discharge time. Di discharge time is also less compared with the other one. And it based on the uh, this one capacity of the cylinder as well. For the 500 grams, it's six to eight seconds. That means in a fraction of seconds. And for this five kg, 15 to 20 seconds, 10 kg, 23 to 20, 30 seconds. 
but when it comes to the discharge quantity you can observe that only 85 percent of the quantity will be discharged remaining 15 percent will be inside the direct solution itself and one more thing is that whenever you can see that the gas the uh, pressure gauze is on red it has to be replaced with then good uh, pressurized one like the reading sh should be shown on the green meter only the main reason is the, the red one should be handed over to the store or it should be replay by refilled or it should be done with the maintenance so that re repressurizing or quantity changing or the powder whatever the material has been there inside will be changed or the pressure will be uh, pressuring will be done to the cylinders this is one of this main reasons we have to make sure and we have to make sure while working and even the foreman supervisor worker who will be involving the hard work activities and using the fire extinguishers for their work purpose, they should also make sure that the fire extinguisher is in good condition to use in the work locations. Water mist. This is also one of the fire extinguisher type, but in my career, I, I didn't see this type of water fire extinguisher, water mist. The extinguishing substance comes with deionized water pressurized with fine spray to form a mist jet. And this coloring will be white background with transparent uh, wording. Transparent wording normally the transparent means nothing but this, uh, this one will become the fire extinguisher color will be there. It comes under two, two different types of sizes, like three liters and six liters. You can see the jet range and everything, the capacity, and the discharge quantity is 95%. You can use for all classes. Might be the class is boring. Hmm? But the fire extinguishers and everything. I'll stop here itself. If you have any doubts, just ask me. That you, you all will be feeling very bored. Devender, Ravi, Sunil, Kiran. Japan, sir, but I think i Boring, boring down there. Boring and leaden. Far from Paralasa. You want doubts on Tarigan Dipre? They wonder, could doubt it or Batao? Okay. <coughs> ah, this is one of the other one clean agent fire extinguisher. Clean agent fire extinguisher. This one is also new type for me, but the ex uh, extinguishing substance is HFC 23 FP. I don't know what is the formula powder, but I'll I'll tell you in the next class what it is. Okay, don't worry regarding hydrofluorocarbons on one, sir. And then Chaptan, other Sali the Etana. Sir, fire extinguisher gauge on the gauge uh, yantalo, minimum mantha, maximum mantha on the landi. Pressure minimum mo yantha ni yam on the green, manak reading green on the uh, manak reading. Uh, condition on the safety use and safety use on the red, red markings, 
అంటే ఓవర్ ప్రెషర్ లో కూడా రెడ్ ఉంటది ఎంటీ ప్రెషర్ లో కూడా రెడ్ ఉంటది మెయింటైన్డ్ ప్రెషర్ కి గ్రీన్ ఉంటది గ్రీన్ లో ఉన్నప్పుడే యూజ్ చేయాలి ఓవర్ ప్రెషర్ లో కూడా యూజ్ చేయకూడదు యాక్చువల్ గా ఓవర్ ప్రెషర్ లో కూడా యూజ్ చేయకూడదు రెడ్ లోకి వెళ్ళిపోద్ది ఒక్కొక్కసారి ఓవర్ ప్రెషర్ మీకు డిపెండ్స్ అపాన్ ద టెంపరేచర్ అది చూసుకొని ఒక్కొక్కసారి టెంపరేచర్ వల్ల ఓవర్ ప్రెషర్ అవుద్ది అది మీకు నార్మల్ గా పెట్రోల్ ఏమవుద్ది వేపర్ ఒక వాటర్ బాటిల్ లో పెట్టి సన్ లైట్ లో పెడితే ఏమవుద్ది వేపర్ అయితే లోపల బాటిల్ లో అప్పుడు ఏం ఫామ్ అవుద్ది మాయిశ్చర్ ఫామ్ అవుతుంది మాయిశ్చర్ వల్ల ఏం ఫామ్ అవుద్ది ప్రెషర్ అవుద్ది అదే సేమ్ అవుద్ది కంటిన్యూస్ గా సన్ లైట్ లో ఓపెన్ లొకేషన్స్ లో మనం పెట్టడం వల్ల ప్రెషర్స్ ఒక్కొక్కసారి ఎక్కువ అవుతాయి ఒక్కొక్కసారి తగ్గిపోవచ్చు కూడా డిఫరెంట్ గా ఉంటది అనమాట అందుకే అది గ్రీన్ ఉంటది దాని ఆ గ్రీన్ దే పిక్చర్ డైరెక్ట్ గా చూపిస్తాను డైరెక్షన్ యూజర్ పిక్చర్ దాన్ని బట్టి మీకు ఐడియా వస్తుంది అండి పౌడర్ ఇది చూసారా ఇది ఒక్కొక్క టైప్ ఆఫ్ కంపెనీ ఒక్కొక్క టైప్ ఆఫ్ ప్రెషర్ గా యూజ్ చేస్తుంది ఇక్కడ చూసారా ఇది రీఛార్జ్ ఇది ఓవర్ చార్జ్ ప్రెషరైజ్ ఎక్కువ అయినట్టు ఓవర్ చార్జ్ అంటే ఈ గ్రీన్ రీడింగ్ లో ఉన్నప్పుడే మనం యూజ్ చేసుకోవాలి అలాగే కాదు ఇది ఈ టైప్ కూడా ఉంటది మళ్ళీ ఈ టైప్ కూడా వస్తుంది రీఛార్జ్ ఓవర్ చార్జ్ మనం గ్రీన్ లో ఉన్నప్పుడే యూజ్ చేసుకోవాలన్నమాట అది ఇది చెప్రవి సార్ ఇప్పుడు రెడ్ లో ఉన్నప్పుడు ఏనా అది కంబషన్ అయినా అవుతుంది సార్ మామూలుగా సిలిండర్ యూజ్ చేసిన కంబషన్ ఏమవదు ప్రెషర్ లేదనుకో ప్రెషర్ లేకపోతే అసలు పౌడర్ బయటికి రాదు వచ్చినా కానీ చాలా తక్కువ అమౌంట్ లో వస్తుంది ఓవర్ ప్రెషర్ లో ఉన్నప్పుడు ఏమవుద్దంటే హోస్ బ్లాస్ట్ అవ్వడానికి ఛాన్సెస్ ఉంటుంది లేదు అంటే వచ్చింది కూడా పని చేయకుండా పని చేయదు అనమాట దానివల్ల ఏమవుద్దంటే నథింగ్ బట్ ఇట్స్ ఇట్స్ ఆఫ్ నో యూస్ ఓవర్ ప్రెషర్ ఇట్ మైట్ బి ఓవర్ ప్రెషర్ ఆర్ డీ ప్రెషర్ వన్ ఇట్ వోంట్ బి యూస్ఫుల్ ఫర్ యూ అట్ ద టైమ్ ఆఫ్ పుటింగ్ అవుట్ ద ఫైర్ ఇఫ్ ఇట్స్ ఇన్ ప్రాపర్ ప్రెషర్ గ్రీన్ గాస్ ఇట్ విల్ బి యూస్ఫుల్ యాజ్ పర్ ద వాట్ ఎవర్ దీస్ స్పెసిఫికేషన్ దే హ్యావ్ గివెన్ ఇట్ విల్ వర్క్ యాజ్ పర్ దాట్ వన్ ఓన్లీ ఇఫ్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఓవర్ ప్రెషర్ 
it won't work as per the uh, description whatever they have given like uh, the jet range will be this much uh, the discharge time will be this much and everything it won't work as per that one because we i have uh, used uh, mt1 as well as over pressed also it might sometimes hose might that it might damage the hose pipe also if it's over pressure देवेंदर कुछ जवाब भी नहीं है हाँ